really never thought I would sit here and make another one of these videos, but that's not what happened. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am giving you round two of my phone case collection. <sighs> I think I said this way back in November when I got my phone. I was gonna still say 11 Pro Max for whatever reason. The 14 Pro Max and currently this is what my lock screen looks like because I'm just really into the white 2k right now I don't know something about it was just like calling to me that's what my phone's looking like right now was not originally going to have a massive phone case collection I was like you know I'm just gonna have a couple I'm not gonna go crazy anymore we're not gonna do it yeah we thought wrong a lot of collections came out and you've probably seen a lot of these in hauls already so if you have I apologize but we're just gonna revisit them and I did end up purchasing some that I really love and that I got some for free. So if you want to stick around and see the start of my next phone case collection, basically, keep watching and let's just get right into it. So first, obviously, the one that's currently on my phone is this pink silicone one. This is not purple. It looks purple, but it's like, I don't know, it's like a weird color. I actually personally really did not like this color when I first got it because I bought this for my old phone and never was able to use it. I'll just buy it for this one. And then I put it on this phone and I really was like, I hate this. I it's so ugly but now I've like kind of grown to love it I love how silicone it is retails for like 40 bucks I know I don't think it's I mean maybe it is worth 40 bucks I feel like nowadays they're gonna pick and choose if it's gonna be really good quality for the money that you're spending that's kind of how I see things now especially like with clothing and stuff as I mentioned previously like if it's good quality I don't mind spending the money if then I'm not going to do it again. And Velvet Caviar has had really good phone cases that have worked for me. Had some hiccups with them in the past. <laughs> Please don't hate me. I do also appreciate that they do comment like on my posts if I tag them or something and I'm like, oh my gosh, like it just makes me like really happy and I love that they engage with their customers. So uh, that's the one that's currently on my phone. It actually matches my little Y2K inspired background. The trashy girl bimbo era, totally me. So next we're gonna just go into the, con the, <laughs> the bin, which, uh, is not just phone cases, it's also like, I have like some random stuff in here from my closet. We're just gonna go in the cases first and then we'll just go back into the accessories, which you guys have pretty much seen. I feel like my accessories really have not changed, it's just the cases for the most part. So let's get into it. First case that I had on my phone, which came in this packaging, is another Velvet Caviar case. This is the Opal case, I really love it a lot. It is really good quality, again, and very sturdy and she looks so pretty Especially against the silver pop on my phone it just makes it look so pretty so I really love this case it's very gorgeous it's actually from Shein this is just an all blinged out case which is absolutely gorgeous I originally was gonna use this for like Christmas time and New Year's because I was like oh my gosh it's so pretty I only made it like a week with this on my phone only because I did not like the fact as you guys can see that the lip at the top of it ends literally right there and there's no like it looks like there should be more crystals around it and there's not so that kind of bothered me and I have lost a couple of the crystals of course again this is from Shein so like I'm not expecting like a one quality here but it is uh, a little at the top like there's some glue some are missing there there's one missing on the side there but for the most part it did hold up pretty well I do really like it but I if I want another case like this I'll probably look elsewhere but that's just me to promo myself for a minute so uh, y'all already know the drill Next ones are from Case Defy, and if you guys do want to use my code 15, Samantha Regina, you will get 15% off your order. I love Case Defy. They have a new clear collection out, which is supposed to be really awesome, and your cases will not tarnish. They won't turn that weird yellow color that a lot of clear cases do, which I love. And they have the little MagSafe thing on there. They are drop test, made of recycled materials, the whole nine yards. I love Case Defy. This is my second time working with them, and I'm very excited about it. So this was actually the case that I had on my phone, and I probably will continue too i love this phone case so much it's just this really pretty pastel -y color oh my gosh it's just so gorgeous this is one of my favorites i don't know i'm starting to like really pick and choose which ones are my like favorite but definitely cases that are very very protective such as these are awesome so i have used this one quite a bit then i also just took this one off my phone as well this one is just customized with my name at the bottom and has the little magsafe thing there which fun fact i'm not a huge fan of this i wish it was like clear but you know pick and yeah Eh, eh, you know, you get what you get. It is very protective because I actually did drop my phone. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see the scuff marks right there. I actually dropped it a couple days ago 
this past week and it was completely fine and this protected it like no other so definitely case to fight cases are awesome i really love this brand and i'm not just saying that because they sent these to me but i truly do really love them a lot they're very good quality i do think they are worth the money they are expensive but i think they're worth it especially if you are a one phone case kind of girly or you know like your mom or your sister or whoever and they are like a one phone case all the time and they need protection on their phone definitely go for a case to fi case they also have a whole bunch of other different kinds there's the bounce ones there's the impact ones there's so many different kinds to suit your needs and that was my promo thank you thank you for sticking with me through that also send me this like clear one that has nothing on it but i might actually put a picture or something inside it when I do use this one so that one has not been used yet <laughs> okay next we have one of the brats collection from velvet caviar you guys know when this mm -hmm, that makes so much sense when this collection first dropped I was like oh my gosh I'm getting every single case and I ended up getting four out of the five cases that they came out with including this uh, I think it's called the brats berry one but it is so so cute I absolutely love it it's just pink and then it has to Chloe, Yasmin, Sasha Jade, CC Velvet Caviar, Subject TTYL, take a pick, it'll last longer. Like, it's just so brats, and I really love this case, and they're very, very good quality. Again, all the way in the back, I did buy more privacy screen protectors. I got these off Amazon. I'll put a link in the description if you guys want to check them out. They also come with the lens protectors as well. I don't really like those. I tried. I attempted. I attempted to have them on here and I just, I can't do it. I'm not a fan of the lens protectors at all. Someone's gonna have to like really wow me with a lens protector for me to want one, but I don't know, I'm just not a fan. Now we're gonna go all the way from the ones that are next in my rotation line that I'm next to be using, but that doesn't always work. So next, this one is new. I haven't even taken the plastic off it. This one is the Nikki Damar M Darling Case Defy Collection. I guess she came out with her own collection or her own case, I should say, and a whole bunch of other influencers are doing that as well, and whoever gets the most sales gets to donate the most money to the charity of their choosing, I believe. I could be wrong, so don't quote me. But she came out with this Revenge Era case, and for some reason, this looks so good to me on a purple background. I've really been into lavender and purple lately. I don't know what's going on with me. I've never been like a purple person. Like my nails were lavender for a week. Like I bought a lavender shirt from Skims. Like I don't know what's going on. Like I'm just really gravitating towards lavender and purple but I ended up getting it on a impact case and it just says revenge era which i absolutely love because i'm i'm always going to be in my revenge era again we already know i've been through my journey i'm still going through it as we speak because nothing is linear ways i'm always in my revenge era i don't give a f anymore it's amazing but again if you want to use my code and save 15% off this I know Nikki has her own code but if you want to use mine it's much appreciated and honestly anything I do make just goes right back into my channel or it helps David and I out with like our bills and stuff like that so it is much appreciated if you do use my code which is 15 Samantha Regina okay I'm done with the promo now this I could not find on Amazon anymore the listing is gone I haven't used this one yet maybe this weekend I don't know obviously my Hello Kitty one I've had this case so many times for so many phones I love it so so much me the case it's girl it's cute and I definitely love her I love her so much this is just just a weekend case for me or like a vacation case a special occasion case whatever you want to call it I would not use this every single day for work because this does not fit in my pocket and there's just no way I will try to now that I'm thinking about it on my Amazon storefront I will try to have a phone case section on there so if you click the link in the description for my shop there should be a section for phone cases and I will try to find another link to a different listing with this case specifically because the one that I again bought from is not there anymore because I went back to look and it's not there. Okay, so my next few couple cases are from the Forbidden site that we don't really shop from anymore. I have like refused to shop from this site now just because of the clothes quality and everything. New phone, I wanted some also kind of like cheapy cases that I could just like wear like on the weekend, stuff like that. So obviously I got this pink one. I don't know how protective it is, so we're gonna be very careful when this is on my phone. But it just says, note to self, you gotta do this for you. This isn't for you. I just love what it says on there and it's hot pink. This is gonna look absolutely gorgeous. Very excited for this one. Had this case for my 11 Pro Max and I ended up getting this gummy bear case again for my 14 Pro Max. I could find similar listings on Amazon for these. I'll put them on, on Amazon. I will not link Shan. Last but not least, I got a furry one. I've been trying to have a furry phone case for I don't know how long and every time it either comes bent or it looks awful. So we're gonna see if this one lives up to the hype. This is just a white one and it has this cute little rhinestone 
around the camera with a little bow. Don't work out. I only spent a couple bucks on it and I'm not that mad about it. So there's that. Next, we are going to go on to, these are all cases I have not used yet, which is just really embarrassing on my part. I got another Louis Vuitton brown case, of course. I got this actually from the other Forbidden site. So if you guys want the link to it, DM me on Instagram. I'll give it to you. Really, obviously, Louis Vuitton is one of my favorite designers. I'm not someone that's going to go spend three grand on a bag unless, unless it's my dream bag, which we've already went over that. We went over that already, so we're not doing it again. I just really, really love Louis Vuitton. It's like my favorite designer out of all the designers, Louis just always been for me. Maybe it's a Y2K thing. I don't know. But this is for my 11 Pro Max, and now I have it for my 14. Next are all of my auto fly cases. I have three of them because two of them are the exact same. So I have a little story time for this, okay? So if you watch my What I Got for Christmas video, my mom actually got me one of these for Christmas. And before that happened, I actually already bought this case for myself. Amazon package got delivered to a different building in my complex, and I never saw it again. So that was great. I ended up repurchasing all the stuff like getting refunded and rebuying re it but I forgot to tell my mom about that but she was like what case what case is it I'll get it and I was like oh well I like this case whatever so she ended up getting for me so now I have two of these I might be selling one on Poshmark just cuz gonna keep the one that she bought me obviously I'll now sell the one that I got this is what it looks like it is basically like a white very light pink case it's so pretty it looks like the Apple store cases which I'm here for I do like the Apple store cases I had one for my what phone was it seven plus i believe the pink one and i love that one so much it was just so classy but now they're like more trendy or it's not even just that they're trendy it's just it's the aesthetic it really is that like you see on tiktok and whatever and i'm not about to be spending 50 dollars on a phone case just because it has an apple logo so got these off amazon and i think they were like 15 bucks each again my amazon storefront is linked in the description so uh this is the exact same one so that one's probably gonna go on my poshmark if any of you guys are interested in it i'll probably just list it for like eight bucks or something or give me a best offer i really don't care and then this one obviously i bought myself for black friday which is this neon oh gosh i love bright colors so much oh look at that come on this just gives me a joy you don't understand like bright neon colors have always just been like a love for me shout out to my grandma because i got it from her it's just hold on just take a moment just like a moment of silence it's beautiful it is beautiful if you are someone that appreciates hot neon pinks and neon colors never really grew out of your y2k slash bimbo era trashy bimbo era like me mm, 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 mm. like i could just oh i will always appreciate a good hot pink it's weird though i love bright colors and i've said this before in videos too so if you've been here i apologize for repeating myself a million times that's how i do here i literally can be like all neon pink and like bright colored one day and the next day just like i want to be aesthetic and have and be like basic colors like i don't know like I, it's like my interests are like either i'm like one extreme or i'm the other like i'm trying to mesh them but you get it i don't know it's it's complicated okay so my last couple cases are again from the brats collection you guys have already seen these before in the past but i did end up getting this purple one and it's like a astrology-ish kind of one it has all of their chloe jade yasmin and sasha's let's say characters they're like symbols on there but it's purple and holographic and really really pretty i do really like this one a lot we'll see how the purple looks on again lavender hi lavender i don't know what's going on and then there's this brats one which come on come on i wanted to be chloe so bad when i was little and now i'm just her grown up in my own way okay and then this one i really love this is just their all of their eyes as like little butterflies and stuff which i didn't know i was like oh it's butterflies it's cute but no their eyes are like all all in it literally so freaking cute and nude that's like a good fall case i'm excited that's all of my cases i'm not sure if the brats and velvet caviar collection is still on their site i believe it is i know that they have other stuff such as airpod cases they have the little keychain things to go with it as well i keep forgetting i don't know i don't remember what else there's actually one more phone case in that collection as well but obviously i didn't buy it because it just wasn't speaking to me like that also in my collection obviously i have a few of these i keep calling them, these phone charms they're phone charms this one is from amazon it's like an astrology one and obviously has my oh my god feel focus can you focus please scorpio on there as you guys can see very pretty then this one is from case i have yet to use this one actually and it's so pretty with all these pearls like i'm absolutely obsessed it's so pretty and then this one is from velvet, velvet caviar i got for free in my order and i really love it because it's really giving me y2k vibes i really need to just like put this on one of my phones i'm just i don't know i don't like things getting caught in my pockets and i have to put my phone in my pocket quite a bit at work so i'm always like uh, do i really want to put this on there or i'll put them on my my keys or on your, my purse or whatever you definitely don't have to just put these on your phone i do want to give a couple honorable mention shout outs because i feel like i haven't talked about 
about it enough. If you guys have been here, then you know that Smartish sent me a whole box of goodies and stuff, which I highly appreciated and I still appreciate to this day. So thank you guys so much for sending me all of that. I never got to end up using a lot of the, any of the phone cases, which really upset me, but I do use the charging cord. So I will put pictures up right here of that cord. It is so awesome. I use it every single night when I sleep. It is just amazing and you could change out the ends of it. So if your partner has like an Android phone or like any other kind of phone or you need to charge something else, it has different connectors. It's not just an iPhone cord, which is absolutely amazing. Also the charging little magnet dock. I can't figure out the name of it, but this little pink one they also sent me. I use it every night. I absolutely love it. It keeps my cord right there so I don't have to like go searching for it on the ground. I've attached like my MacBook cords to it as well. It's just really nice and easy to convenient to keep all of like your power cords together like just stuck together so you know where they are and you have to go searching for them at night or when you're trying to charge something so that is a definite plus so thank you again so much to Smartish for sending those to me I do really appreciate those products and their cases look amazing and I'm really upset that I forgot to use any of them <laughs> I'm so sorry I'm sorry on to accessories this box has like a whole bunch of purse stuff in it but everything is basically the same i don't know if there's anything new to share in here with you guys i apologize there's nothing really different in there to show it's just all the same from the previous video i just have some extra purse things in here so with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed this video and gave you some ideas of cases you want i don't know i've always like now that i'm older i've just noticed in within myself a lot of things have changed especially with cases like I'm not even gonna lie to you guys being fully transparent right now there's I'm thinking about actually getting rid of some of these cases and selling them because I know I'm probably not going to use them I feel like I'm drifting more towards just using one case all the time and that's not me so hopefully that's not the case if I do end up listing anything it will be on my Poshmark link will be in the description down below so with that being said I love you guys so much hope you have an awesome day subscribe if you want to see more of me like this video if you enjoyed turn on bell post notifications so you'll win the I post a new video. Happy shopping, I guess. Again, I'll have all my my Amazon storefront, my case to fi case. <laughs> case to fi case. I wish I had a case with case to fi. Can you imagine? Oh, it'd be like neon pink and pretty. Oh my gosh. It would be clear. It'd be neon pink. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. If I was a big YouTuber, I would definitely do one. Also, I'm thinking about, again, bringing back my Etsy shop for like the millionth time. So let me know if you guys would be interested in that. I know I kind of like started it and then kind of faded away from it and then a whole bunch of stuff happened. So. Haven't done that. But anyway, I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.